Hey, what's up everyone? Kurt with Roadside Guy. Appreciate you guys tuning in to the channel. We're here at uh, Stingray Chevrolet in Plant City. This uh, Chevy dealership's about five minutes from my house. And we are here to see the all new 2020 mid-engine Corvette. So uh, we'll take a walk inside and I'll show you guys the new mid-engine Corvette. All right guys, we're at Stingray Chevrolet. You can see the line here is pretty long. Everybody's trying to get a look at the new Corvette. Here's some of the old Corvettes they've got in the showroom. Steve Hurley of uh, Stingray Chevrolet. It's got a nice classic car touch in his showroom. Limit 30 seconds per person. All right, you see they've got snacks out. And it's like a, uh, a whole big ordeal. Come down here and see this car. Here's some of the new seats they've got for the new Corvette. 2020 seating options for the Corvette. And here's a look at the car. Wow, what a beautiful car. Kind of looks like a, a Ferrari and a Corvette mixed. What a beautiful car. I can't wait to see these on the road. I've seen one on the road in uh, Kentucky on my way to Roadkill Nights in Pontiac, Michigan a few months ago. And that was the first time I saw one. But uh, of course I didn't get a chance to get up close with it like I am now. So this is a real treat. They're gonna have the car here today until seven. And then tomorrow, I think until 4 or 5, I'm not quite sure. But uh, it's only going to be here for uh, a few days before it moves on. <clears throat> you can see on the backboard there, they've got the paint codes and wheel options for the car. Okay guys, we've made our way up to the 2020 Corvette, the mid-engine Corvette, and here's the front end. Here's the new headlights. Give you guys a look at the new grill down here. <laughs> really? There you go. There you go. Wheels. Look how dirty this seat has already gotten from everybody sitting in there. Right? I know, right? The car is about 15 years old by now. Right. Like my man said, this car is already 15 years old from all the people sitting in and out of it, and he ain't lying. Just look at the wear marks on the seat there. 
All right, we'll take a look at the interior. Let's see, we got this kind of the center console area there. Is that badass or what? Check that out. Too cool, man. Too cool. I think I can like the square wheel, but when you're driving, you're chilling with the wheel, it's pretty cool with the square. Yeah, you probably need it with that kind of horsepower. Here's a look at the engine. Back here in the back. And of course, you got your top for your topper. Your top back in there. Access and place that quite yet. So we're still waiting. Then you've got your back glass on your back glass. Hey guys, so on the new Corvette, I'm checking out how to unlock the vehicle. And you see down here on the bottom, it has a little tab. Looks like that's where you would do that. Pop that. And of course, you've got your buttons to unlock, to lock, and to open the door. And when you hit that, you'll see that it, or you can hear it, it triggers it. And here's the interior. We've got a kind of a square steering wheel here. We've got all our gauges and clusters here for park, reverse, neutral, drive. And then we've got all the stuff for like our AC, our tilt for our uh, seats, our climate control, syncing our radio, we've got our touch screen here, rear view mirror, and glove box, and then you can see right through the back glass, right here into the engine compartment. Oh, you're good. Sorry. Go ahead. You're good, bro. He doesn't like it. He You got the vented uh, trunk here to let some of the air cool the engine off. It does call for zero weight 40. Mobile one, zero weight 40. There's the emissions on this vehicle. A little bit of the passenger side. I don't think I shot any video of this side of the vehicle. And then, of course, you got your door handles here. See, you just reach under here like so and touch. I don't know if I can show you because my light's not working, but it's got a rubber touch back here, and that's a, that'll pop the door for you. That's the side angle of the door there. And here's the air vent to go into the back engine compartment there. All right, guys. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you enjoyed seeing the car. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Drop us a comment on the bottom. And we'll see you guys on the next one.